Hey, what's up everybody? This is Dom and today we are checking out a new Cydia tweak called ICS Lock Pro. And what this does is it puts a, uh, dare I say, Android-ish style lock screen on your device. And so I'm going to go ahead and show you exactly how it works, though it does bring some pretty cool functionality here. So once you have the package installed, you'll notice this new HTC Lock Pro icon on your home screen. And so if you go ahead and tap on that, you'll see all the different options we have here. Now, before I get into the options, I'm going to kind of show you how this works. So I'm going to lock my device. And what you can do here is this is the new lock screen. So we have these little bubbles, right? And each of them has a different app inside of them. So we can take this little bubble here and drag it over to different apps and it will open that app. So it's actually pretty cool because you can set four custom apps out here and then just drag the circle over to the app and it will open it up just like that. And then if you just want to unlock the screen regularly, you just swipe all the way to the top and it'll open it back up to whatever page it was on. If it was on the home screen, you swipe up and it'll take you back to the home screen. So let's check out the options here. Inside of here we have an enable switch, active, you know, you can have it on or off. Then we have a dock switch, and I'll show you that in a second. We also do have a ring style where you can choose from a different style ring. Then we have a bubble style, and this is the bubble that surrounds the app icon. I personally like the clear one, but they do give you three other options here. And then we can set custom apps. So we have one, two, three, and four. And if you go in here, you can choose from any app on your device to be in that bubble. So I'm going to set some different ones here. Let's go to camera. Let's go to App Store, and we will then choose Calendar. And then you can also set it to Vibrate on Unlock, and that's totally optional too. But now in order to make these changes take effect, we do have to respring the device by hitting the Save button and then tapping OK. So as you can see here, we have these different bubbles. I can unlock it to the camera, just like that. Or we can go to Voice Memos pretty much anything. It's, it's really cool and it adds uh, some customizable options here to your lock screen. If you quickly go to certain apps, it just makes it very convenient to just be able to slide up to that bubble and then go to that app. Or like I said, swipe all the way up and it'll just unlock it like normal. But inside of the options here, we do have this dock. And when we turn that on and we save it, just adds this little bar. That's what gives it more of that Android style look there. But we still can use it exactly the same, and I think it's a pretty cool tweak. It's uh, it's only 99 cents, and it is available in the Mod My Eye repo. It's a pretty cool lock screen replacement. Let us know what you think in the comments below. Thanks again for watching, everyone. This is Dom, and have a great day.